हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू आर चैनल आयुर्वेद स्टडीज आज हम एन आई ए दैट इज नेशनल इंस्टीट्यूट ऑफ आयुर्वेदा डीम टू बी यूनिवर्सिटी राजस्थान जो जयपुर में लोकेटेड है इस यूनिवर्सिटी के बारे में हम आज बात करने वाले हैं इस वीडियो के दौरान हम पहले सबसे पहले इसके ब्रीफ हिस्ट्री के बारे में देखेंगे कहाँ पर लोकेटेड है यानी कि लोकेशन देखेंगे कैंपस देखेंगे कोर्स विच इट ऑफर्स साथ ही साथ जो है यूजी के सीट्स कितने हैं फीस कितनी है कॉलेज की स्टाइपेंड कितनी है पीजी की सीट्स फीस एंड स्टाइपेंड कितनी है साथ ही साथ रिजर्वेशन पॉलिसी और साथ ही साथ अन्य जानकारी भी हम प्राप्त करने वाले हैं तो वीडियो को एंड तक जरूर देखें तो लेट्स बिगिन फर्स्ट विल सी विद ब्रीफ हिस्ट्री यानी कि इसके पीछे की हिस्ट्री क्या है एन जयपुर की The National Institute of Ayurveda, deemed to be university, is an apex institute under the Ministry of Ayush, Government of India, for promoting the growth and development of Ayurveda in the world. It serves as a model institute for evolving high standards of Ayurveda education, including teaching, training, research, and patient care, and also to invoke. scientific outlook to the knowledge of ayurveda system of health care for global acceptance the jaipur pink city was established around 294 years ago and under this heritage city department of ayurveda was start, started back in 1865 at maharani sanskrit college jaipur called as jaipur school of thought In due course of time an independent ayurvedic college was established in august 1946 by government of rajasthan and this college was taken over by government of india and named as national institute of ayurveda nia on 7th february 1976 this was one of the few ayurvedic colleges in the country to introduce post graduate education in ayurveda as early in 1970 under this institute now this institute has achieved the status of deemed to be university under de novo category on 9th november 2020 our honorable prime minister of india dedicated it as deemed university to the nation on 13th november 2020 after its establishment in 1976 the institute has grown tremendously in the field of ayurveda teaching training research patient care etc as a result now it have 14 specialties for post graduate education as well as regular fellowship program leading to phd apart from this national institute of ayurveda also offers graduation course that is bams diploma course in ayush nursing and pharmacy and also going to start interdisciplinary programs msc in six new specialized areas since its existence it has continuously been engaged in promoting reforms and developments in ayurveda system of health care at national and international level the institute is not only a premier institute under the central government but also amongst apex institutions in the field of ayurvedic education and training in the country now let's look at the location where it is exactly located the university is located at bravar singh gate amer road jaipur and the capital city of rajasthan state jaipur is a heritage city and one of the world's most pictorial with the world's first ancient planned city It is popularly known as Pink City of India, a name derived from a, it from its pink sandstone buildings. The institute is situated at the center of Jaipur, which is about eight kilometers from the railway station and about fifteen kilometers from the Jaipur International Airport. Two national highways, number eight from the New Delhi to Bombay and number eleven from Agra to Bikaner, in western rajasthan pass through jaipur now let's look at the campus the main campus of the institute consists of multi storied buildings for the academic and hospital complex 
The academic complex includes 20 teaching departments, attached laboratories, chambers of the teachers, offices, seminar halls, museums, lecture theatres and classroom fitted with the modern teaching aids like DLP projector, audiovisual aids, library etc. Whereas the hospital complex includes 280 bedded NABH accredited hospital, OPDs, Panchakarma unit, central laboratory, deluxe wards, cottage wards, yoga unit etc. A satellite clinic with 20 beds indoor facilities provides healthcare services at the Jawaras, Jawhar Nagar, Jaipur. In Jaipur, there is also a NIA city, Bombaywala Hospital with 20 beds in the heart of the city and is 4 kilometers from the main campus. An OPD clinic is also being run by NIA in Jamba Ramnagar town of Jaipur district which is dominated by SC and ST populations. In main campus, there are five separate multi-storied hostels for boys and girls including GMP certified pharmacy equipped with electrical furnaces and machinery for manufacturing various Ayurvedic medicines. The staff quarters for essential staff, guest house, water tank and reservoir etc. are also in the main campus. There is also a well furnished auditorium in NIA with a capacity of 500 seats. Now let's look at the UG seats fees and stipend. UG BMS course offers 125 seats. So that means it has 125 seats and the fees course fees includes 42,025 per year. Internship opportunities includes in university, hospital internship is for one year for final year students in internship. 23,500 salary is offered to the students monthly. Hospital is attached to the university. Internship is six months for an Ayurvedic hospital and later six months for an allopathic hospital. Now let's look at the PG seats, fees, stipend and reservation. PG seats includes 130 seats. Distribution of total 130 PG seats includes first is for central government nominee 14, one in each subject. Second is foreign national 7, which includes 3 BIM STEC countries plus 3 South East Asian countries and 1 Malaysia. Third is state government in service candidates 21 and remaining Rajasthan and other states th total 88 seats. All India seats is 44 and NIA passed out is 22 and Rajasthan state is 22. Now look now let's look at the fees for the Indian nationals. First year is 81,750 including the caution money. Second year is 54,500 and third year is 54,500 again the same. Hostel fees includes 22,500 per year. Stipend is 42,560 plus DA in the first year. Then rupees 45,600 plus DA in the second year. Then at the third year we have 48,640 plus DA in the third year. Subject wise seat matrix is first is Agat Tantra 7. Ayurveda Samhita Evam Siddhan 10, Dravyagun Vigyan 11, Kumar Bhrutya Balrog 8, Kaya Chikitsa 11, Kriya Shari 10, Panchakarma 8, Prasuti Tantra Evam Sri Rog 9, Rachna Shari 9, Rash Shastra Evam Bhaisajya Kalpana 10, Rog Nidan Evam Vikriti Vigyan 11, Shalakya Tantra 8, Shalya Tantra 9, Swastha Bhrutya 9. Now let's look at the functions. First of all, the undergraduate, postgraduate and PhD level programs, teaching and training leading to the degrees of BAMS, MD or MS, MSc Ayurveda and PhD Ayurveda. Second is training to medical officers and teachers of Ayurveda as sought from other state government. Third is diploma in the Ayush nursing and pharmacy and panchkarma technician course. Fourth is certificate courses for Shah Sutra, standardization on Ayurvedic medicinal plants, advanced course on training for the beauty care, 
through ayurveda nutrition and dietitian dietitians in ayurveda training on ayurvedic methods of cooking primary health care through kitchen spices and local plants stri rog sthanik chikitsa and panchakarma technician fifth is conducting rotp cme tot and similar programs for the benefits of teachers medical officers and physicians of the country for getting advanced and updated knowledge sixth is collaborated research and national level institution and also with the foreign countries interested to adopt ayurveda as a system of medicine in their countries seventh is foreign exposure training programs eighth is undertaking ppp projects for specialized treatments training and research ninth is providing ayurvedic treatments to general public through its opd and ipd services tenth is providing ayurvedic treatment to sc and st inhabited areas of the rajasthan under the scp or tsp scheme subject to budgetary allocation 11th is active participation in arogya melas exhibitions etc and last but then all the least conducting national and international level seminars and conferences now this was all about nia for more update subscribe and like and share our channel for more videos keep liking sharing and subscribing our channel for more videos keep supporting our channel guys thank you so much